Good morning and welcome to calendar time. Let's feed Fred. I think he's waiting for us. Good morning, Fred. There you are. And if you want to, we'll check on our ant friends. They have been busy tunneling. Look at all the new tunnels they've made. Let's see if we can look for a moment and spot one. There he comes right here. He's right inside there. They really like this side. They kind of get down in there. And so it's kind of hard to see them sometimes there. I think this is their favorite spot. Okay. Well, did you know the Bible says consider the ants? The ants are hard workers. And I hope that we work hard today. Let's start right now with our calendar time. Sue's going to come up and we're going to say the pledge together. Sue, come on up. Good morning, Sue. Did you have a great weekend? I'm so, so glad. Would you hold the flag for us so that we can do our pledge? Okay, we'll hold it up high. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you, Sue. That was a good job. Okay, so let's get started with our calendar. You want to sit down so you can help us count? Okay, so sit down, Sue. <laughs> Goodbye, Sue. Sit down and you can count too. You can count with me too. The month is April. Looks like we're almost halfway through April, but let's start right here and count. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Today is April twelfth. Can you say that? April twelfth. The year is two thousand twenty one. Now, if you go all the way up to the top of the calendar, you'll see that today's day of the week starts with an M. M sounds like this. Mm. So what day of the week starts with the mm sound? Mm, Monday. Today is Monday. Let's sing the days of the week song. You can snap two times or you can clap two times. Days of the week. 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 There's Sunday and there's Monday. There's Tuesday and there's Wednesday. There's Thursday and there's Friday. And then there's Saturday. Days of the week. 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 Of the week. So today is Monday and we need to add some new straws to our pockets because we had Saturday, Sunday, and then one for today. So here's the one for Saturday. Oh. And look what's going to happen. Nine is going to change to 10. So that means that we need to move those tens. And I have a rubber band right here. We're going to move all 10 of these straws to the tens place. So there is one set of tens. We're going to put them right there. So how many sets of tens are there? Just one, just one set. So I'm going to put a one right there. Okay, now we still need to add one for Sunday. It's all by itself, so it's a one. And we need to add one for today. So there are one, two, two ones. So there's one set of tens, and there are two ones. Together, this number is 12. And actually, it's today's number. Remember when we counted? There are 12 straws, one for each day of April. So that number one and two is 12. Well, that was pretty fun. Let's turn around now and do our, count, our weather together. 
Can you look outside and see what your weather's like today? Okay, well, let's sing about it. What's the weather? What's the weather? What's the weather like today? What's the weather? What's the weather? What's the weather like today? It is, it is, it is out today. It is, it is, it is out today. Well, the season is spring, and if it's windy where you live, it might be a great time to fly a kite. Today in our letter of the day video, we're going to be talking about letter K and kites. I'll see you then. Goodbye.